a St. Lucian company is now in the business of selling aviation fuel to piston engine aircraft. The proprietors behind the General Aviation Service say the business could be a tremendous boon for the George F. L. Charles Airport. General Manager Sylvanus Ernest says the St. Lucia Air and Sea Ports Authority, as well as the Eastern Caribbean Civil Aviation Authority in Antigua, has given the venture the nod of approval. We bought a fuel truck and get the fuel and got the permission from uh, SLASPA to operate um, at George F. L. Charles Airport. Ernest says the island could become a major refueling stop for southbound aircraft. The aviator says the venture means airplanes no longer have to travel to Martinique and St. Vincent to get serviced. He says increased traffic could translate into more business for the airport, including landing fees and other costs. Um, I can see a lot of more traffic coming in here for fuel because, um, again, uh, a lot of people don't like to go into St. Vincent because of the, um, the approach. Some people don't like to go in and out of there. So they would rather St. Lucia. Also, going across to Martinique, people just rather uh, St. Lucia. is just one of the, 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 the best fuel stop for everybody. Many new businesses end in failure, but Ernest is upbeat about the prospects for general aviation service. He says the company has two things in its favor, location and the cheaper cost of fuel. We know it wouldn't just benefit just general aviation services, but the airport, the country on the whole because of every aircraft that land here, I have to pay landing fees and stuff like that. So I can definitely see even the French guys, um, based on the price of the fuel here, the, even the French guys will leave Martinique and come here and um, get fuel. Ernest says General Aviation Service has enough available fuel to meet market demands and has a current capacity of 6,200 gallons. Winston Springer Jr., HDS News, Channel 4.